Hi guys, my name is Jazz and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, I discuss everything fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. And this video did so well, I figured I would do a part two because I got so many new sunglasses in, but this is another sunglass haul, designer luxury sunglasses. I do have a few which are affordable, but I wanted to show you some new ones that I got in because some of them, one of them is off my um, luxury wish list that I wanted this year. So I'm super excited about it and it's like that time of the year, guys. Sunglasses, you know, we don't have to wear the mask as much, um, even though we probably should, but it's all about the added accessory of sunglasses. I've been finding like that I'm just becoming super obsessed with collecting them again <laughs> which is like so fun because honestly with the simplest thing you have on if you're able to accessorize with a cute pair of sunglasses it's going to be everything and I'm wearing my feather top from Club London and I will link it down below I love it it comes in a bunch of different colors I know somebody's gonna ask so I figure I will tell you what I have on but anyways let's get into the video um so I don't know what I want to start with but a few of these you've probably seen, if you guys follow me on Instagram, you've probably seen before, but let me just get into the newness. The newness first. So I got this precious green box. Now look at this, it's like, even the box, even the green is, you know, Bottega, Bottega Veneta. So <laughs> this is my first Bottega Net Veneta purchase, like ever. Um, so I'm super excited about these and these glasses. Wait till you see, guys, wait till you see, like wait. So we got the green box here. So let's just open it up. Um, I didn't take the tag off because I don't take my tags off of things until I'm literally out the door wearing them. Um, Cause I just figured that's just the smarter thing to do in case you change your mind. But these I have not, I'm not gonna change my mind. But these are the cat eye sunglasses from Bottega, um, Veneta. Um, they've been out for a while. They come in this black style, but they also come in like, I believe like a tortoise um tortoise like frame um it has like the Bottega symbol on the side which is like that cool gold but I've been wanting I have like black sunglasses but every time I want to wear like black and I go for a pair of sunglasses I don't have one that matched the vibe that I'm going for I have like the way they ones Abizas that you guys saw in my last video but something about these I just needed to have so let's put these on like look like, let's take a moment and just look at these glasses. Like, so dramatic. The cat eye is, like, perfect. I just love them so, so much. I think this is, like, probably my new favorite pair of sunglasses. Like, it's just giving boss. I don't know you. What are you saying to me? Like, like literally. <laughs> so, I'm obsessed with these glasses. These are probably, like, my favorite out of the ones that I'm going to show you guys. But... I love these. So if you were thinking about these and you wanted to see how it looks on the face with somebody with like braids or like my kind of face shape, these are how they look, but they're super fabulous. I love them. I believe they retail. I got them from Saks. I believe they retail for about 400, um, which is, you know, it's up there. Usually I don't like to go past the 400 point with luxury sunglasses because at the end of the day they are sunglasses, but these are really cool. And even cat eye ones that I have from another stories and like the Celine other dupes, they're not like these. They're just not. And I just love them so, so much. So this was the first pair of glasses that I picked up. Um, again, Bottega. Of course, everything's going to be linked down below. But guys, I'm obsessed with these. Obsessed. Obsessed. So we put them back in my, you know, my fabulous green box. <laughs> and go to the next one. So the next one you guys probably seen on Instagram. Um, I've worn them a lot of times and I always wanted like a pair of white sunglasses, which I have um, in my Prada shades that you saw in the previous video. But I, I never had like a neutral, like kind of like cream tan. And I thought like, oh, why would I need a cream tan if I can just wear the white? But like, I don't know about this color. And maybe because it's not as stark, I wear them so much and they are like fabulous <laughs> as well. So... I feel like Lueve just does sunglasses correct and they always get it right every time. Like the frame is all super huge and dramatic which I love and like. The frame, the actual frame itself is uh, black but it's not too dark and of course they say Lueve on the side here. But I just love these. These are so easy to wear and I find myself grabbing them even like casually on the weekends to wear with jeans and like um, sandals or flip flops or whatever I might have on and I don't have to think about them too much. You know you have sunglasses that you have to think about, like is it gonna go or is it like is it not? These I kind of just tend to grab and they just fit like perfectly. 
I believe these are called, actually I don't know what these are called. Mass? No, that's not what it's called. I have no idea what it's called. Well, of course I will link it down below, but I love these. Um, the shade is like a beige and they just go perfectly. Even if I wanted to wear what I have on today and just kind of like, you know, go out with these glasses, they would fit the vibe perfectly and they're great. Um, one thing about I love about Lueve glasses, like some glasses that I have, especially like Gucci, you have to kind of like keep sliding them up and they fit a little big on the face. With Lueve, they always fit me like perfectly tight. I know you can obviously get your glasses tightened, but they just fit me perfect. So I just love the brand. And like I told you, that's like my brand this year. Maybe I'll get a Lueve puzzle bag. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll keep our options open. Um, but the next pair um, is from Lueve as well. So you guys know I have the Ibiza sunglasses in the black frame. So I saw Karen Brichik and she had these on like during fashion week and she just looks so cool and like so fabulous and like I hate to say the word funky but she looks just funky and cool. So I was like oh I want to try this and they were on pre-order for a while and I forgot I ordered them and when they finally came in I was like oh I don't know. So tell me what you guys think about them. I have them in black. These are in the white with kind of like the frame is like a metallic almost. They look really cool. It was, it's gonna be a lot with like my feather top today, but you know, you gotta catch, you know, catch the vibe. So let's see. Move this braid. And I kept the tag on because you know I'm not sure. I think they're cool. Like I look like really cool and funky. Let me know what you guys think um, in the comments. But these are the Ibiza and the white shade. I believe they have white with black frame these are the white frames with like reflective silver lenses um, which is really cool because you can kind of wear with everything I like these glasses and this style because they're every time I wear them I get compliments people are always like oh my god what kind of glasses are you wearing because they don't really know you know what they are they're just different and unique and then I just feel like even if I wanted to wear like a white t-shirt jeans or like denim shorts and just like a cool like plain sandal and I have these cool glasses on that makes the outfit so it's all about you know adding the added accessory to kind of like you know just make it your outfit pop so I like these I think I'm liking them you know low wavy on the side I'll pull up so you guys can see but like really cool I like how they look let me know what you guys think in the comments like white you know what are we doing here I like it so <laughs> those are the three luxury glasses that I wanted to show you guys. The next two options that I got are affordable and a really great, great price point, especially if you're somebody who's like, listen, I don't want to spend $380 to $400 on glasses. That is absolutely fair um, because sometimes I don't either. Um, but I talk about free people all the time. So free people, probably to me, besides like all of the fast fashion retailers, have the best sunglasses because they're affordable, nothing's over $40, and they look expensive, honestly. Like, the affordable ones I showed you in my last video are under $30. These were $32 or $30, something like that, but again, affordable. So I got these because I wanted, originally I wanted a cat eye lens with a yellow um, tint, but I couldn't really find that, and I saw Cardi B earlier this year with them on. So I definitely wanted a yellow lens, but because it's such, you know, so tricky, I didn't want to really spend and invest a ton of money on it. So I got these from Free People. So look at the yellow lens. I already rocked them and they're super fab, super light. Um, one thing I like about Free People sunglasses is that they're light on the face. Like you could wear these all day and you don't have to worry about, like sometimes with darker frames, you're wearing them. You're like, oh, let me take my glasses off, but I can't see. With this lighter frame, you don't really have to worry about it. And look at the yellow. Like, so light on the face. I can wear it with this outfit. It's super cute. They're comfortable. I believe these come in, like, an orange tint as well. But I just think they're so, like, they're so good. Like, they're so good. Like, I don't know. Like, if you are not sure about sunglasses and you just want to try a different, like, different trends, different options, check out Free People. I will link some of my other um, favorite Free People sunglasses down below as well. But they're another brand that when I wear their glasses, I get... So many compliments, but I just love how light these are. I love how retro they feel without feeling costumey and like super light on the face. You can wear it without really worrying about going inside and not being able to see. Love. Love. Let me know what you guys think of these in the comments. Again, they come in different colors as well. And these last ones, I picked these up from Amazon. Don't you hate like sometimes when you go on Amazon and they pick things for you that you know you'll like and then you end up ordering it? That's what these glasses were, but these are super cool too because even though I have the 
Loewe ones, which are obviously a higher price point. These kind of give the same kind of cool vibe and they were like, I think $14, $14.99, $13.99. Super inexpensive, but again, cool looking as well. I don't even know the brands on Amazon, but they look like they're like a designer pair of sunglasses and they're, honestly, they're not. They do have the reflective lens um, on there. So when you sand back, they look like silver. Silverish, which is really, really cool. Um, I like these a lot. Of course, with white sunglasses, the only thing that annoys me is like your makeup is on it all the time, but that's with any glasses. But how cool are these? Like literally, so cool. Super light on the face, super inexpensive. I think I'm almost positive that these do come in black as well, like black frame and like, they're just so cool. Like look. So cool, such a little vibe. 13, 14 bucks, like why not? I think I am done for the summer as far as purchasing sunglasses. I think I filled every hole in my sunglass wardrobe for what I needed, but you know, you never know. Sometimes you might just like pop up and get something else and you just never know. I don't know. I think I'm done, but I had to share these, these few with you guys. Let me know what your favorite one was down below. Let me know what you think about the little way they, um, Ibiza sunglasses in white. I think they're cool. I think I'm going to keep them, but let me know what you guys think in the comments. Check out Free People if you're looking for affordable sunglasses, but let me know which ones were your favorite in the comments down below. Be sure to like this video and subscribe, and until next time, guys, be safe and be well. Bye.